Hi, Jesse here with Razor Sharp Networks, and I got another great training for you in regards to Facebook content calendars. Of course, this is a one and seven part video series where we're going to be covering our content calendar provided by Razor Sharp Networks to help out with Facebook posts and engagement so you can communicate a more, a more clearly defined message and uh, hopefully engage your Facebook community to track more of the customers that are looking for your products and services. So before I get started, I don't know if you've signed up for our training. We're quite literally giving that away. And uh, I'm sure that if you want on one of our syndicate site, there's some links below uh, in the description of this video. And or if you're on our website watching this video, I'm sure there's some subscribe here uh, buttons that uh, we would encourage that you go ahead and click through that process and get signed up. Um, there's some incredibly powerful content on our training site that can help you market your business more effectively online. So I'm going to jump right into this training and, and today is Wednesday and we're going to cover uh, Facebook posts and engagement for Wednesday. Uh, the first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and log into Razor Sharp Networks so that I can gain access to the Facebook content calendar and get an idea of what I want to post and how I want to engage the community. As you can see here we have a schedule for each day of the week uh, that gives us the ability to kind of plan out our posts and engagements and help out with our Facebook marketing. Uh, so first and foremost we have for Facebook posts, uh, post an easy to answer question on your company Facebook page. This could be any question non-industry specific. Make sure that it's easy to answer that, so you can increase your community engagement. So again, if you're posting all kinds of content, you want to make sure that you vary that content, but you have some consistency in regards to the information that you're providing. So what I'm going to do here is go ahead and log into my Facebook page for 4C Communication and uh, go ahead and make a post there that has to do with uh, something that's non-industry related. Of course, Today here in Napa, it's raining incredibly hard and uh, we love the rain. So what I'm going to do is just post a comment about the rain so we can engage our local community here. And uh, it might also reach out into some of the people around the country and uh, strike a nerve with them. But uh, I like to plan out these posts in advance. As you can see here, I can cut and paste this in here and uh, go ahead and post it to the Facebook page, Facebook company page. And uh, quite literally in 15 seconds, I've created a new post. Most people, it takes them hours, weeks, or years in order to uh, figure out what they want to post. And uh, inevitably, they don't post anything, which uh, kind of hurts their Facebook marketing campaign. So the next part would be to take a look at your Facebook engagement for Wednesday. And as you can see here, we have a fan of the week post. And this is one of the things that I really like to do. I like to spotlight our fans or the people that are engaging with us inside of Facebook. And for our company and customer sites, we make this really easy. We actually utilize an application from Box Sheets that gives us the ability to spotlight these fans and uh, reach out to our fan base and people that are engaging in the conversation and recognize them on a regular basis. We've also, for 4C Communications, created a special promotion where uh, what we do is we take our fans for the entire month for the, um, and we, we spotlight them each week and then at the end of the month we pick one of those four fans at random and give them a free month's worth of service uh, as a, a sign of gratitude for engaging in the conversation on a regular basis. So what we'll do is we'll go over to uh, our 4C communication site and as you see here we have uh, a fan top fans tab application deployed on the 4C communication site. And we'll, we'll wait for this uh, to load here. And we're going to recognize our top fans. As you can see here, this will pull the information. Uh, Cyril, Cyril Alvarez is the, uh, hopefully I got that name correct, is the fan of the week. Um, so this application actually tracks the engagements and helps us spotlight that. Uh, and what we did is we actually just created a little blurb here that we want to add to the recognition. And we're going to share this on our Facebook page. Now the reason we like to utilize the Box Sheets application in order to publish this content on the page is because what it does is for the top 10 fans it reaches out into their Facebook page and makes a post on their page. Uh, so we can actually reach out and engage people on their personal pages. 
So as you can see here, we can review the post. It says, congratulations to uh, Mr. Alvarez. You are the top fan of the week. Besides being added to our list of awesomeness, you'll be entered to win a free month of service. Odds of winning one in four. Our winners will be selected at random from our fan of the week. Winners, increase your odds of winning by sharing and winning next week. Thank you for joining in on the conversation. So this went out to 10 people on posted on their Facebook pages and you know, it was a real great way to not only recognize people but also to in, uh, increase the Facebook engagement. So that's all the training that I have for you today. Again, if you haven't signed up for our training, uh, I would hi our training site, our resource site, I would highly encourage that you do that in the uh, description below. And until next time, we hope that you make your business a razor sharp business.